Hello, hello, and welcome back to Creeper World 4, where we were, we were doing the Spain missions, which, man, it doesn't look like a lot. But that's 26 missions, and we're only uh, doing the second one still, and it's been several episodes. So, let's pick up where we left off. Yeah. And just hop right back in. We're making slow but steady progress on this mission. I very much enjoy this game. Oh my goodness, look at that. There's something really satisfying about watching the terraformers just smoosh all of that down. Let's move them up a little bit so they can do a little bit of work over here. And actually, let's bring in... Oh, you know what? That other guy's still getting some work over here, isn't he? Uh, let's bring him to join these ones anyway, because he'll, he'll be of more use up here. I think. Get a sip of my coffee. Or not, not coffee, cocoa. I keep calling it coffee because I'm usually drinking coffee when I record. Hmm. I'm usually drinking mocha, but today I'm just drinking uh, some cocoa. Select the squad. All right, we're gonna shift the whole squad today. Papa. Just like this. You know, it's funny that I was thinking about like my channel and the type of content I have on it and I like, very much am a variety streamer like for context as of the time I'm recording this the stuff that is going live on the channel or just the week that this goes up we're going to have some creeper world some sims batman uh, arkham origins Cult of the Lamb, Spore, Superland, Papers Please, Rebuild, a tabletop role-playing game, and some Nitrome Flash games. The style of content I do is just all over the fucking place. <laughs> and I wouldn't have it any other way. Because I, I very much enjoy a variety of games. So that being said, the, there's definitely a lean in the types of games I like to play. All you have to do is look at the, the voting sections in the Discord, links down below. <laughs> um, and like, you know, there's certain series that I've clearly given a slight favorance to by giving them a whole section on the vote the, all to themselves, things like Dishonored and Fallout. Careful. Oop. We had a thing go boom. We're going to keep trying to push up and see if we can't touch this corner of the map and clean it up. Because if we can clean this up, that'll help dramatically, I think. Oh, you know what I just thought? Hold on. We could, in theory, easily support three shields. So let's just, uh... thinking here here and here for now but I'm probably gonna move them oh god slow down the game I want you moving over here cuz it's not like I need all of the missiles constant like yeah I I want to keep it so I have less shields than what I'm producing for the red stuff because I don't want to fuck up my uh, 
material for my missile defense systems. The main reason to place these shields is to help with the terraforming process more than anything. But it's also just less other shit I have to build. <laughs> Oh, this shield is gonna displace a lot of creeper once it goes down. Yeah, the shields are very much a thing I always overlook. What does the Emrift do again? I think it moves things. I don't need the Emrift. I remember uh, in, a old, in a lot of my videos I'm saying like, oh, if you have any advice, drop it. And one person was like, advice, platforms. It's like, yeah, the platforms are Definitely a thing that can be very useful if you're on a map that produces the resource you need for them. Alright, squad. Shift over to right here. Actually, no. Shift. I can't use the expansion method that I had been using. Oh! I lost a shield. Ah, uh, yep, I should have realized that the shields would be fucking horse cocky on this map. Just because of how the fucking creeper's been behaving. Constantly forcing its way through my shields. When it has no right to. Here we go. Yeah, the force fields are honestly kind of shitty because of how, like, hectic they behave in terms of actually doing what they're supposed to do and not always holding things back, you know? The fact that they're not always doing the thing you would be building them to do. Oh, God. We're hitting the point where it's becoming hard to push forward here, huh? It's because we're trying to go uphill. That's the problem. Hang on. But now might be actually this might actually be the exact area that I would need to use the shields. Use them to push up and clean this area off. And then that means that there's no more creeper coming down this hill.
Where is my missile defense? We should definitely drop some wood over here, I'm realizing. And a couple more snipers. My terraformers are doing a really good job. Get a sippy sip my drinky drink. So there's a good use for shields, is they're actually really good for crawling uphill. Anti-creeper is very good for going downhill. Shields are very good for going uphill. Most of the time. Oh, oh, the creeper's trying to force its way through. Look at that, it's squeezing by on the edge of the map, even though it physically shouldn't be able to. Come on, let me build. I want another shield, dang it. Give me a new shield, me. Here we go, these shields are a, good, a very good new new tool to be using. I've learned the, the correct use of them in my repertoire. Hmm. Hmm. God, it's so nice seeing, like... How much of the map you've taken back from the creeper. And that will give me what I need to support an additional shield. So let's go ahead and build that right there. And now we're about to take the mount, uh, the the peak of the mountain, so to speak. Holy shit! <laughs> well. Come on, stop pulsing out, new creeper. You gotta keep this area clean. All it will take is a single strand of creeper and the whole thing will expand.
Oh, you know what we should really have is uh, some more pylons running up. And there we go, we've cleaned off this mountain peak. I think our next goal is to stretch down here and take this bitch out. Oh, my cocoa's gone. Yeah, because now we don't have all this pulsating out here, it's gonna make climbing back down the mountain much easier than it was climbing up. And in fact, you know what I'm gonna do? Oh, anti-creeper boys. Why don't you all move on up here, hmm? Oh shit. Ah, oh, it glitched its way fucking through, of course. Come on. There's no way shit should be making its way through here. Alright, you go back over here to help out this process again. Because now we've got anti-creeper to help with over here. In fact, we're going to use one shield in order to focus the flow of the anti-creeper in the direction I want it to go in. Give me the force field. There we go. Yeah, and that's going to help push all the anti creeper off in that direction. So that most of it's going towards the enemy. Let's go ahead and get the squad now and tell them to go over here. Yeah, now, now we're going to just sort of start hugging around the creeper, pushing down to the left over here. Oh, yeah, look at that fucking just splooge of anti-creeper coming down. I don't even need to be building more turrets because of that. Oh, but you know what we do need is some snipers and some missile defense. These snipers are actually going to be Having a lot of work cut out for them with all these eggs. Eggs, eggs, eggs. <sighs> Look at that.
That's just beautiful looking right there. Hey you. Come over here and pop your ass down right here. In order to keep the focus of the anti-creeper going where I want it. I am immensely satisfied with what is happening. Squad move forward just a little bit. Yeah, and then we got the little ring form has all of the anti-creepers forced out of the force field zone. Come on, build those cannons in order to help with holding back the creeper. There we go. Ooh, they might need some sniper support over here, actually. Oh, okay, yeah, we're good on missile defense everywhere. We're gonna need some more over here soon, so let's just reach out a little bit more with that. Yeah, and these shields are focusing all the anti-creeper down along here where I really want it to go. Hmm. Building more snipers won't do anything to hold back the eggs here. Unless I do this. Oh, Travelers, I need to borrow one of you. Is still... Did I ever finish the Terraform project here? Not really, but I honestly don't need to. Ooh, I want to slow time back down. Come on. Tell Fulma, do your job. Worthy. Tell Fulma, damn it. Dig, need it. God, look at the fucking low frame rate on the creeper when I have it at max speed. Uh-oh, I did not want to... How did that happen? That's why I wasn't terraforming where I wanted it to. Oh, look at that. It's even doing some of the digging that I wanted it to do. Oh, 
Oh, you're kidding me. All right. Give me a bitch that's half height. So I can actually get the energy up to build up there. Ah oh shit, it needs to be higher still. Height 15. There we go, and that'll bridge. Said that'll bridge the energy up, damn it. Yeah, and then this sniper can start fucking up the eggs. Squad, go on down over here. Ooh, slow down the speed. Game is having nannyism. Let's steal another force field from down here in order to continue the focusing method. Again, the goal is to just focus all of my anti-creeper in the direction that I'm expanding in right now, you know? To where I want it to be. Give it all only one real place to go, and that place being where I want it. A little bit leaks out over here, but that's okay, because that little bit leaking out helps out over here, so... Ooh, our sniper's actually doing a little too good, it feels like. Oh god. Ooh, thank you for the follow. Oh god, everything's going wrong. Oh god. My sniper killed too many eggs. I made the creeper too powerful. Oh, I hope that actually doesn't fuck me over. Come on, you just gotta hold back this tidal wave, guys. Which it looks like most of the folk are doing pretty good. Oh, I might have just unleashed a monster. Took out too many eggs all at once. But it looks like things are going okay oh, for the most part all over, which is good. The anti-creeper getting unleashed in the back there helped out a lot. Our defenses ho are holding firm. Oh god, the force field got fucked up right here. I think we are good. Now let's move this one back up over here. 
Yeah, we're fine. Whew. So we've got three. I can build two more shields. Four. Five. Let's replace our sniper and let it continue its work. Because the end result wasn't that bad, so I think we can afford to repeat the experiment without too much negative consequences. Oh, what times do I usually stream? Uh, it says it, I, I, I usually stream around 11 o'clock EST. Uh, sometimes impromptu streams will happen to other times. Uh, on my YouTube channel at the start of every week, I put up a video. Uh, YouTube channel is the same as my Twitch channel, Ollie Rick. Uh, I put up videos sh announcing what streams I'm going to be streaming, or what games I'm going to be streaming at the every day of the week. So you can always go and check that out. squad just go out there and fuck up the creeper for a little bit My anti is doing a good job of holding back the wave that was released over here, which is nice. Hey squad, move out over here. I need you more over here now. So your, your help with mitigating the wave created by the sniper was very much appreciated. Ah, uh, yeah. It's just like a good orgy. It's all coming together. Although I realize we've just hit the 30 minute mark again. So, I think we'll be wrapping up this episode there. I think we've made beautiful progress and I think you would all agree. The creeper is very much struggling against me now. It's only a matter of time at this point. Uh, the day that this goes up on YouTube, I'm actually getting nice and far ahead on the recording schedule right now, but uh, yesterday an episode of Batman Arkham Origins went up. Very, very fun. Been loving that game. Of course, if you want more Flash-related games, there's Nitro, and Rebuild, blah, blah, blah. You all know the spiel. Click the end cards appearing now. Give me a like. Give me a subscribe. Give me a comment. And give me a kiss on the lips. <laughs> I'll see all you later. Mm. Ta-ta!